What's up, guys? Tassin here. So, time to do Heroes Quest, guys. We're going to become a hero. Woohoo. You need 25 herb, 50 mining, 53 fishing, 53 cooking. Um, you'll also need a partner. If you remember when you did Shield of Arav, when you either chose the Black Arm Gang or the Phoenix Gang, you're going to need the opposite of what you are. So, if you're in the Black Arm, you're going to need a Phoenix. If you're in the Phoenix, you're going to need a Black Arm. I'll have to get someone later because um I don't I was I was planning on doing this with a friend but he can't do it right now so I need to just get this done so I can get back to room crafting so I'm just gonna do it myself so some things you'll need is you'll need something to kill level 111 in a very in a big multi combat area with a lot of level 57 ice warriors anti poison dusty key some food bringing a glory to get to uh to be able to get to drain ore in a couple of places a phoenix necklace to be able to uh uh, go uh, come back here when we when the quest is almost done a fishing rod if you're in the Phoenix gang you're gonna need bow a bow and an arrow bow and arrows if you're in the black arm you're gonna need full black uh, without minus the kite you're gonna need um, minus the shield I should say uh, you're gonna need a vial of water 60 GP a horror lander fishing bait room pickaxe um, uh, Anti-Dragon is strongly recommended, and some Teleport Ruins to Varrock and Falador. So, alright, let's get this started. Uh, we're in the middle of the, we're uh, at the Heroes Guild, north of Taverly, south of Birthrope, and we're going to talk to her. And, and she's going to say you need three items. You're going to need the armband. You're gonna need the ar an armband, an eel, and um, and a cooked lava eel. So, all right. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get ice gloves for the uh, for the feather. So I will meet you guys on uh, on White Wolf Mountain. All right, guys. So here we are on White Wolf Mountain. I'm gonna show you how to get there. We're gonna need to um, come up here. If you uh, if you ever noticed when you're on White Wolf Mountain, and I'll show you the little dungeon marker and uh, how there's rocks in front of it. Yeah, that's uh, that's where we're gonna need to go for this quest. So we're gonna run up, and we're going to head over here. Make sure you have your pickaxe, and you're gonna need to mine the rock slide. I'm gonna get it down. And we'll walk in, and then, all right. So we're gonna need to go down any ladder, I guess. And uh, I guess it's the middle one. And then we're gonna go up this one, and there should be two. Nope. All right. Uh, I'm not sure exactly which one it is. I don't really remember. So don't go down the middle one. Oh, sorry. Use the southern ladder. I didn't. I missed that part. So a southern ladder. Um, gonna run up here. Long. We're gonna have a long run, guys. So just uh, the heck. All right. I'm gonna pause the video for a second, guys. So yes, go down the south ladder, and then we're gonna go down here, southwest. Um, up this ladder, and there should be two. Uh, there should be two ice giants. We're gonna take the eastern ladder down, and um, now we're gonna go north along this tunnel. I'm gonna pause the video till I get there because it's a pretty long tunnel, and then just um. Uh, when you get when you get there, we're going to uh, it's going to dead end to a ladder. So uh, I'll pause the video until I get to the ladder. All right, guys. So we made it to the end. We're going to go up here. Now we're going to go down this ladder. And now we're going to go here, and we're going to follow this. Um, we're going to follow this. Uh, this. We're gonna follow this up here till we get to the whole bunch of ice warriors, and the ice queen is right there. 
so I suggest protect from melee, and uh, let's kill her. Uh, you can use anything to kill her, it doesn't really matter. Um, I am going to pause the video until she's dead, but wait one second, let me see if there's a safe spot for her. I don't think there is. No, there's not. But that's okay. Just uh, just kill her, and I'll start the video back up. After you kill her, we're going to need to go to Draenor, so I'll meet you guys at Draenor. Um, after she dies, pick up the ice gloves and then go to Draenor. Alright guys, so we're at Draenor. Um, bank everything except your ice gloves, and uh, bring your fishing bait, vial of water, Harlander, 60 GP, and a fishing rod, and uh, teleport to... Um, to Falador and make things a little bit quicker. So um, we're going to go to Entrana now, so I will start the video back up when, when I get to Entrana. Alright guys, so we're at Entrana, run east, and then run uh, and then run northeast, up north near the... Um, if you ever uh, were making laws or running laws and you were wondering, um, why the hell is this Entrana Firebird, this just, just random ass creature, is just in the middle right here, we're going to kill him. And then after he dies, he's going to drop a, 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 a fire and train a bird feather. Or whatever it's called. A fire feather. And we need the ice gloves, because if you don't have the ice gloves, you can't pick them up. So now, um, I'm going to meet you, Now we're going to... Normally we get the Master Thief band next. But, um, I'm going to go ahead, because I don't have a partner yet. I'm going to go ahead and do the Lava Eel first. So, um, take all this. And uh, I'll meet you guys at the fishing bait at the fishing shop in Port Serum. All right, guys. So we're at the fishing bait shop. We're gonna talk to uh, Garen and uh, tell him you you want to catch a lava eel. He gives you this. Um, you're gonna use a Harlander with a with a vial of water. Then use the uh, snail oil with that, and you're gonna get blamish oil. Use that. Oops. Don't drink it. Uh, use it, and you're going to get an oily fishing rod. Now we're going to teleport. Um, now we're going to teleport to Falador, and uh, I will start the video back up when I get everything I need to finish this part. All right, guys. So for this part, we'll need the fishing bait, oily fishing rod, dusty key, anti poison. Um, I'm bringing teleport runes to uh, um, Lummy and Varrock. Um, so, because after I go to, after I go to Lummy, and you, you just need to get anywhere where there's a range, so, and you're going to be in combat, so, um, I said, uh, so, I suggest bringing teleport runes and not using your home teleport, because you probably won't be able to unless you, unless you run out, so, I'm going to go ahead and, um, I'm going to get to the blue dragons, guys, just keep following, um, the dungeon down here until you, um, and instead of going the way you get the dusty key, you want to just follow the, uh, or if you have 70 agility, you can go in through there. I'll make everything a lot easier. But um, instead of going there, instead of going um, in the, where where the Black Knights are, you just uh, cross the bridge and then cross the bridge again. And uh, you're going to use the dusty key by the lesser demons and it'll take you to the Black Dragons. Um, all you really need is an anti-dragon, uh, you'll need an anti-dragon shield too so you can get one shot at by the Blue Dragons. So um, I will start the video back up when I'm at the Blue Dragons. Alright guys, so here we are at the Blue Dragons. Um, what you're going to do, is you're going to run this way. Um, pass these dragons into this little room over here. When I run out of run. You're going to go into this little room over here and there's these fishing spots. And these fishing spots are where the eels are at. So, um... Go in here, bait fish at the fishing spot, and you're gonna get an eel. Now I'm gonna teleport to Lumbridge and hope, and I'm gonna get my cooking gloves because I don't know if you can burn this or not. Um, I don't know if you can burn this or not, so I'm gonna grab my cooking gloves and see if I can cook it. But try and cook it, and um, hopefully you won't burn it. I don't know if you can or not, so uh, we'll see. One second. Alright guys, so luckily I didn't burn my eel, and I hope you can't burn it, and you guys didn't burn yours. So now that I'm part of the Black Arm Gang, I'm going to talk to Katrine with a full set of Black Armor. Um, is there any way I can get a Master Thief? 
and uh, so we're gonna have to steal something from him. And so I'm gonna pause the video, guys. I'm gonna have to find somebody on uh, who's doing the quest as well on the Phoenix Gang. So um, I'm gonna see if I can find one. I'll start the video back up. And uh, sorry for you guys who are on the Phoenix Gang. I will only be able to show you the Black Arm Gang part. So um, you're gonna if you're on the Phoenix Gang, um, you're gonna have to um, you're gonna have to look for you're gonna have to look at another guide to show you if you want to see how to do the Phoenix Gang part because I will not be able to do it. So for those of you in the Black Arms Gang, you know you're with me, and I will uh, I'll show you what to do after I find somebody. I'll be right back. Hey guys, so I found someone. I got lucky to find them, but uh, it's all good. So he's walking to Karamja, and I'm gonna do my part. So if you're in the Black Arm Gang like me with your full black on. You're going to you're going to go to this odd shaped house in Brimhaven, and you're going to try and come in here and it'd say four leaf clover, and um, you're going to go in and you're going to talk to Grubber. Oh, I'm sorry. Talk to Trobert. Tell him you want the uh, candles, and uh, tell him you'll volunteer to take that mission. He'll give you ID papers. And so, um, make sure you have your full black on. Uh, we're going to run over here. And we're going to try and go in. We're going to get stopped by Garv. And uh, you'll go in. And uh, hmm. ah, we're going to need to talk to Grip right here. Uh, to ask him about your duties. Ah. Uh. And then say anything I can do now. And he's going to give you a key. And now you have to take that key and trade it to your, uh, and trade it to your friend wherever he's at. Mine's in here. So I'm going to run to him. And I'm going to trade him the key. Make sure that your partner has bow and arrows cuz uh he's going to he's going to need the range. Um All right, now one second while I uh remember how to do this. Alright guys, so after your Phoenix gang member is in place, um, one second, uh, once he gets back I'll start the video again. Alright guys, so uh, you're gonna come into this room once your partner's ready. And uh, tell him something that'll provoke grip. And uh, oh my gosh, there's a freaking guard in the way. He'll come in here. No, okay. What the heck? I hate it when this happens. Alright, let's try this again. Search the cupboard. And these stupid guards won't get out of the freaking way. One second. Uh, yeah. What the heck? Alright, now that he's in here, I'll close the door. And, uh, your, fr and your friend's gonna shoot him. And then after he dies, we're going to pick up a key, so I'll start the video back up when um, when he's dead. Alright guys, so after you tr after you uh, get the key, you're going to walk into this room, open that chest, and get two candlesticks, and then you're going to go and give one to your uh, to your partner. And so we're going to go, and we're going to give it back to Katrina, and then we're going to go, and I will meet you guys back at the Heroes Quest for the finishing of the quest. Hey guys, so we're back at the Heroes Guild with our Cooked Lava Eel, our Fire Feather, and our Thieves Armband. And... There we go. Now you can wield a dragon battle axe and a dragon mace. And you can go in here. And uh, at the bottom you can charge your glories. So that's Heroes Quest, guys. Uh, hope this guy was helpful to you. Please comment, subscribe, and like my videos. Keep a lookout for more. Come into my chat and talk to me. And uh, tell me if there's any videos you want me to make. So thanks for watching, guys.